Hello and welcome back to Cardboard Decoy Plays Tropico. So the capitalists want us to actually have paid health care, which I'm kind of thinking about, except here's the thing. I need happiness. So happiness health care is doing pretty decent um, right now. So I want to preserve that while we're working on all of our other happiness that we need to be doing. So I am not going to do that. Um, I'm going to go Mr. ahead and President. abandon. Alright. New luxury Did entertainment building. And let's see. Export oil. Secret police. We should be exporting oil like any second now. Secret police. We're like way in the negative as well. So I'm trying to do anything I possibly can Our to... Uh, oh yeah, I need to issue this edict. Monthly upkeep per police station. Such as... There we go. The Issue. operation was a huge success. Oh, now it is time for my favorite part. Nothing makes the Tropicans more optimistic and assured of your leadership like some witch hunt. Hola, I envy you, Presidente. Let oh my me God. tell you a secret. In an attempt to boost the domestic sunglasses industry, El Presidente has approved the launch of a new top secret wow. agency. Shh, don't tell anyone. How I wish I could sign the orders to execute and banish those rebel leaders. That, and the fact that you can write. Interesting. Um, let's see. Execute or banish all rebel leaders on the island. Uh, okay. So now we need to find all the rebel leaders and uh, then do stuff with Presidente, them. Presidente, we are hunting a killer here. And real hunters need cabins. So, one minute. I'd like to look out for the bad guy. Okay, cool. So we need to build five cabins. That's a fairly important one, apparently, and that'll give us a free entertainment building, which will be good. So let's see. Let's see. We're looking for rebel leaders, and I imagine they'll pop up eventually, but uh, that we'll wait until that actually happens. Oh, wait, no. It looks like we already succeeded in that one, so our military standing has gone up pretty much automatically. So, oh, let's go rebuild all. I have no money. Hold on. Stand by. We've got to wait until we actually get money. What is happening to our cash flow? Trade. Ah, okay. We have a few ships that are back. Pineapples, milk, meat, tobacco. I'm looking to see if there's anything crazy. Yes. Add ship. You need at least... Oh, we need to have standing with the uh, U.S. for that. Add ship. There we go. Cool. All right. Now, I believe we still have our steel mill, right? Yeah, there's our steel mill. So hopefully that will help our cash flow a little bit, because right now we are basically broke. So we need to figure out how to make these things better. I think a lot of it had to do with the fact that our gold mine got torn down for a little bit there, but everything seems to be fine there now. Let's see. We got... This place is not completely occupied. Lifetime profit. We'll go ahead and demolish this. Okay. Let's see. We have a lot of poor people over here, apparently. Yeah, nobody's getting into that house. That's interesting. Who's staying here? Select. Shack, miner, wealth, poor. Okay. Why are you not living somewhere? I've got, like, living places for you people. Let me see if I can't just build an apartment and then make it a poor person apartment. Alright. Residential... Hey, I've got enough money to actually build something again, so that's good news. Okay. USSR sent us 9,000. We're exporting stuff. Good, good. We just need that to continue happening at a faster pace. Faster and faster. We'll see what happens. Okay. And, yes. Not too terrible. President, Tropicans await elections next year. They wish to show their everlasting love and... There we go. Yeah, we're going to be fine. No big deal. Okay. Let's see. You are select... Mm -hmm. He's well off. Interesting. Oh, we're not done building apartments over here yet either. Okay. Well, hopefully that'll solve at least some more of our homelessness homeliness problems. So, let's see. Wealth provided. Poor. Economy hotel. This is well off, well off. Yeah, let's see. Hola. Who are you? You are a rebel. You will be arrested. K. 
Okay. Let's see. More research cotton, more stuff exported. Everything's moving along now. I spent a lot of money trying to take care of things in a panic once again, but it seems to be okay now. Yeah, oh, also I built a supermarket and you can do El Prez action figures, which adds money to your bank account, or Swiss bank account. The U.S. want to stash some of their missiles here in Tropico. In order to avoid suspicion, they suggest we hide the rockets in waste treatment plants. Not the brightest plan I've heard, but you can only expect so much from these Yankees. Okay, waste treatment. Let's see, this is a new concept to me. Is it under infrastructure? Geothermal, waste treatment, metro station, raw resources, hydroponic, industry, hmm, chocolate factory, vehicle factory, jewelry workshop. This isn't any fun. First of all, let me look at this really quick. Luxury entertainment. New luxury entertainment building. Yeah, that'd be really easy. Uh, children can't visit the casino. Preferred tutors class none. And I bet that draws a pretty decent amount of profit too. So let's go ahead and build one in our little tourist area. And there we go. We tried to discover democracy, but it proved extremely difficult. Building a true democracy is like chasing a unicorn. Everybody has heard of them, but no one has ever seen one. We captured a whole herd of unicorns, <laughs> but not a glimpse of democracy anywhere to be found. However, we did discover the expectation of democracy, which should be more than enough for simple tropical. Wow. Well then. All right. So now we have more constitution options. Police discover special citizens uh, such as rebels faster. Uh, reduced liberty, assassination, and banish actions cost less. Uh, high liberty, assassinate, and banish are limited. Special citizens are harder to discover. We're going to do security surveillance. All Swiss bank accounts gains increased by 20%. Buildings with managers gain 10% bonus effectiveness. Budget impact on buildings effectiveness is stronger. Let's see. Uh, do, do, do. Uh, what would be good? I kind of like this. Planned economy and free market. Let's do planned economy. There we go. And media requires higher budget. Journalists convert voters to your cause. I rather like that. Eh, less liberty. Protests happen less frequently. Total propaganda. Uh, or media provides more liberty. Protests happen more frequently. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we'll do subsidized media. Uh, let's do less often voter fraud, totalitarian state, mandatory elections that happen more often, and no uprisings. I kind of like that. Yeah, I think I can maintain that. Political rights, happy childhood, late retirement, normal life expectancy, and workers' paradise, early retirement, job happiness. And we'll do that. And, oh, what is this? Immigrants Nation. More educated immigrants. I think that might be a good idea. Hmm. Because we're starting to get more and more educated positions required. And let's see. Visa program. More educated immigrants. Hmm. <laughs> let's do that. Wealthy citizens vote. Fewer voters. Fewer voters. Fewer voters, reactionary wealth description, more voters based on crazy liberal ideals. Yeah, well then. Uh, political rights democracy. Uh, let's see. Armed forces, no education for soldiers. Additional militia squads raised in battles. High school soldiers, high effectiveness. We're going to move to militia. And then we need to start building education. All right, let's do that. I have no idea what that did to my uh, political standings with everyone, but let's hope it was good. So, what else do we need? Housing is starting to decline. That's okay, we're working on that. So, hopefully with uh, the visa program, it will also help with our sort of issue that we have at the moment. Uh, oh, everybody's going to be high school. So, now I have unmanned buildings. Okay. Okay, interesting. Very interesting. Okay. What can we do? What can we do for welfare, research, and education? Uh, high school, college. Okay, cool. So we'll build a couple high schools, and hopefully all of our kids as they grow up will become military people, and that will be good. 
And so now let's see what ends up happening. This apartment is being built up. Well provided, well off, well off. Yeah, that's enough housing for... Okay. They're slowly repopulating all of our military facilities. So the visa program and the military redesign that I did, hopefully things will be a little bit better. Okay. As in, people who import will also be able to serve in the military a lot easily, is what I mean. Let's see. Okay, cool. Required poor. There we go. That's what I want. Alright, so this is poor people apartment. Housing quality is still 65, so that's good. And uh, let's see what that does to hopefully relieve some of the problems there. So, El Pablo C. Decoy is 56%. Uh-oh, this isn't good. People, happiness, what do we need? What do we need? What's the lowest right now? Housing, religion is still really low. Ugh, freaking religious. All right. Let's do... Well, we gotta wait till we have money again. So, that might take a minute. Okay. Let me see. People... Education, wealth, managers, education, illiterate, grade school, high school. Yeah, we need more high school people. Politics, factions, religious are indifferent to me. Why? Good day. Let's see. You're rich. Why don't you like me? Happiness. Mm, new home. I can sleep in the streets. Text. Oh, okay. He's rich and there are no mansions. That's why. All right. Okay. So we need to start building some mansions as well for our newly rich-ish people. Let me see. We need go to Almanac. People. Homeless. Postgraduate. College. High school. And broke, poor, well off. Yeah, we got some homeless, poor, or well off people. Rich, we got a couple rich people who are homeless. And let's see, okay. So there's a couple thoughts I have on fixing the housing crisis of Tropico here. Well, I'll definitely have to see how that actually ends up working out, but it's an idea nonetheless. First of all, hmm. Alright, we might build some more new apartments, poor apartments. Yeah, this one's already fully occupied, so that was definitely needed. And then we can also, let's see, hmm, <laughs> I'm thinking. You guys, why you got that hat on? That's hilarious to me. You're well off? Okay, so let's go ahead and build some normal houses, as soon as that actually becomes an option again. Alright, we need high school people for this. Baccarat tables. Slob tourists. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> Alright. I want, I, I want to be more slow and decisive about my decision-making process here, because I have not been doing that. Alright, first of all, I have a high school, right? Yeah, here's a high school. Maybe we need another high school. Let's see. Mm, planned economy, constitution, principle. Okay. Let's put a high school over here somewhere. Man, I've got to figure out how to get my money back. I am, like, not making any money at all right now. Very bizarre. Let's see. Obviously, this is going to, well, yeah, 0 out of 50. Okay. This is interesting. I don't know what we're going to do. I'm feeling kind of at a loss at the moment. And my uh, approval rating is not doing great. Edicts. Martial law. Wealth tax. Generates uh, those citizens. Okay. Prohibition. Monthly social security. Early elections. Sovereign debt. What is this? Issue bonds? No. What's going to make people happy? What can I do that can make people uh, happy? Hmm. Interesting. Alright. Let's give this a minute to kind of decide itself here. But it looks like uh, we might actually lose the elections, and that's another fail state. And then I might have to take a break from this game for a little bit and try to figure out, okay, how, do I, how the hell do I beat this damn thing? 
Ha ha ha. After seeing this military situation, though, I'm beginning to wonder if maybe this is not such a great idea to uh, limit my military to high school only, or maybe I did it a little early. Okay. How do we update profits, though? We have four ships. All we're exporting is steel and meat. Do I have cotton plantations? Sugar, pineapple, sugar, cotton, okay. Cotton, add ship. Oil, bauxite, foreign standing. Oh, now we can export oil to the USA. That's going to help a lot. We can add another steel ship. Let's add a ship to rum. There we go. We can't build cars yet, but that's going to be definitely pretty high up on our list there. Hmm. <laughs> Steel, oil to the Americans. The USSR isn't going to like that very much, but we've already got a pretty amazing standing with them, so I'm not too worried. And uh, let's do... let's add two ships to oil. We have an opportunity to influence the outcome of coming elections. Strictly. Better safe than sorry. Okay. Let's see, can I build an oil rig over here? Raw resources, automated oil refinery from offshore deposits. Okay, but that's 13,000. We don't have enough money to actually even look at it. All right, USSR sent us money. Good, good. What is this? Did you know that your clueless lackey Panultimo plans to spy on the tourists by installing statues and gardens with hidden cameras all over the island? Actually, the Order does not mind. Give the Trabican some beauty. After your crimes are proven, it will make a better transition for your rule easier. Oh, make the transition for your rule easier. Plus, it is always a good idea to keep an eye on people. So, let's do that very quickly while we have the money for it. Uh, let's see. Small gardens. We're going to improve our uh, tourist area over here. Let's uh, build some roads so it makes a little bit more sense maybe as well. Okay, Ooh. and a road here. Very free-flowing sort of area. Blech, man, my ability to speak today has not been on point, I must say. All right, let's go. What do we want here? We can do a little pool there. Uh, let's see. Palm tree here. Here ish. Whoa, I switched it to something else by accident ish. Alright, there we go. And there we go. Okay, that's one, two, three, four, five. And then uh, six. I mean, I probably don't need it here, but hey, seven. Eight, nine, and ten. Okay, maybe. Good evening. We probably need to arrest you. Okay, done. Alrighty. Let's see. Nobody. Oh, not connected to the electrical power grid. That's not a good thing. Let's go to infrastructure, electric substation. Build one right there, and then the we'll see where that gets. Happened, we have lost the elections. We were able to secure only 50% of the vote. Presidente, I suspect that this is the result of a mass conspiracy involving at least 119 Tropicans. Have some comfort that at least 117 of your subjects still love you, Presidente. Your opponent called asking you to leave the keys of the palace under the doormat on your way out. A devilish combination of the global economy, the Illuminati, bad weather, and just plain rotten luck made you lose. Uh, please leave your beard and your hat on your desk on your way out. It happens to the best of us. Stay strong, Presidente. The people feel for you. Okay, that was really bad. Um, so, yeah, I lost the election, even with cheating. That is extremely not good. And I lost by two votes as well. All right. Well, this just so happens to be the end dish of the video. So what I'm going to do is 
maybe replay that whole mission and try to figure out something. I don't know. Um, I definitely kind of lost focus there somewhere. Uh, either that or this game is much harder than I gave it credit for. So uh, we'll see. Either I'll go back to Kerbal Space Program after this video, or you'll see me come back and try to do a little bit better or something like that. But either way, uh, yeah, it'll be it'll be up in the air until uh, tomorrow for you, basically. And I'm just going to mess around and see what I can do about it. Either way, this has been Cardboard Decoy playing Tropico 5, hopefully not for the last time. And uh, yeah, if you've enjoyed, please do like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Have fun.